What did you do, homies? It's your boy Dave, and I'm back today. We are here with another damn bull reaction. This time we're checking out his broccoli bars, okay? Now we're gonna watch all three of them here in one reaction, okay? Anyways, allergic reaction to broccoli. So he's allergic to broccoli, and that's a big old piece of broccoli he got in his hand, man. I absolutely love broccoli. Broccoli and cauliflower. Both of those I can just eat just raw. Just just no cheese, no salt. I'm ready. Anyways, let's go ahead and find out what Dan Bull is talking about. Shut up and turn it up. Oh, before I place play, press play, you guys like that broccoli background I got going on back there? <laughs> Hello, my name's Dan Bull. I'm 26 years old, and something really weird happens when I lick broccoli. Watch this. Oh, it must be a joke. What? I'm the biggest prick in this town. The British Chris Brown. Visit your award ceremony and just sit down. Wait, wait, wait. So he turns into an AO when he, <laughs> when he eats broccoli? I slash your tie just because I enjoy the hiss sound. Disagree with this, my sleeves will slip down. Fist down. Ooh. Swing until the 56th round. I can beat you with my wrist bar. The 56th round, bro. They didn't ring the bell. After the fist, because the dude's knocked down, but you decided to activate your time stopping abilities and could 56 rounds, bro. Ha! I list my inspirations in roughly this order Father Christmas Satan and Chris Dorner. I'm spreading disorder. I diss all the rappers who I asked to collaborate and got a this call of raps Piers Morgan, but with a pierced organ. Too much information, too bad. That's the beer talking. I sit too near broads and make him feel awkward. Randy is Ramsey. Now cook me a meal, Gordon. Gordon Ramsay, okay, what kind of rap is this? You know, that has some dis vibes energy, but it looked like he ain't really on no video game type stuff, right? Like, bro I I I'm failing to see the meaning of broccoli here. It looked like he's just spazzing out and then just threw broccoli in there just cuz, you know? Now here's the point where you might think, why they still talking? Slimy, limey, why should I see the appeal of him? And that's the point I travel through, the camera, and slap you till you're black and blue. Rihanna, Alicia. No. He needs to improve her grammar. I'll take a hammer to her new piano. Now you've had a glimpse inside the ill mind of Dandle. Try to get out the doubt, you will find the handle. My lines are angle grinders. They mangle rhymers. I rap into the sky and the air force scrambles fighters. Hey. You stick like a lit tire. I'll bring you down to the ground quick as a zip wire. Okay. Listen to this, my dick is sticking its large. Sick it on the Twitter and tell Nicki Minaj. Not the voice crack. I should never cause gone shit since you had Britain in charge and fuck off if you think that's a little bit harsh. You know, I think I remember uh reading like a little excerpt or something in an article that said that the type of things that Queen Elizabeth would do if if you know America was under her thumb or under her rule. You know what I mean? I can't remember what I read about it. Uh but his his bar right here, America is going crap since Britain's been in charge, got me remembering that excerpt. America's gone shit since you had Britain in charge And fuck off if you think that's a little bit harsh I'll stick a baton up in your doors of perception Snipping the wires, no phone call for protection I get dressed in my Sunday best And I still look less fresh than Kanye West So, give it a hand lotion Phone Frank Ocean I wanna know his exact man to man quotient I'm looping, that's why I'm so this. I run and rub my crotch upon an oh ho While shouting Ooh. over my shoulder No homo There you I go. already had two chains snatched off me. A <laughs> uh, little, little nod towards two chains. It's time for payback, probably. I pack a nine inch winky, bear track cottage, and occasionally I'm. Okay. It's got a. It's got a funny how he goes into the end. Hmm. I might not just. I might just now be picking that up. Is that what kind of raps he's doing? I pack nine like a gun, but then he turns it into like a funny bar. I'm just now, if, if that's what he's been doing in his raps, I'm just now picking it up. May strap shotties, but usually I'll do a drive by screw face at posse. Please and leave the seats of my made back snotty. Green windows looking like they're made of stained glass gothic. Ooh. I'm a misanthropic proper maniac potty. I got crank off a straight black coffee. It was a bad idea to take that straight jacket off me. You just don't have the power to restrain that snotty. I rap with an ill mind. Hey, that's hoppy. I'll tear his fucking face off. Take that, hoppy. 
You know, I was just about to say that, that this kind of had ill mind of Hobson kind of vibes. Your production quality is way bad, sloppy. Or is your weight compression weight that lossy? How can Hobson be the one that is dissing? I'm just showing I can do this and still win the competition. And then it wears off as quickly as it started. It's mystery to me, some kind of allergy, I guess. Damn bull. I wish I had bars like that. As much as I like to eat broccoli, my bars will still be whack. <laughs> All right, y'all moving on to broccoli bars too. Rug buggery. Hello, it's Dan Paul. Some of you probably know this already, but a while ago I was diagnosed with quite a severe allergy to broccoli. But hold on, hold on. What was the time between this? Wow, 2013, 2017, and then 2018? Wow, he had quite a, he, he wasn't lying when he said a while ago. But uh, quite a bit of time has passed since then, and I think I might have developed an immunity. Let's find out. That shrooms. Okay, production quality went up a little bit. I tackle issues like ruggle bear, a blend of gentlemanliness and thuggery. I'll class you with some very expensive bubbly. Bloody luxury. Bone cutlery protrudes from your wounds. Buggery. Ooh, a strummage. Lovely jubbly. You know what's interesting? You know, it's, it's, it's kind of cool seeing, you know, this evolution that Dan goes through with his raps, right? Because I feel like the longer he's been rapping, the more articulate his words. Like his, his pronunciation of stuff just kind of cuts through your ears like knives you know and that's i like that type of articulation when you're rapping like every her every word can be heard you know what I mean? every word could be heard dan bull couldn't be a mumble rapper even if he tried <laughs> it'll come through too crisp a useful excuse to induce you to cuddle me the two teams squeeze together quite snugly rummaging and fumbling with undiscovered subtlety beneath this rummaging will be all coupling i'm roughly as politically correct as little huckleberry finn using epithets no longer customly hot okay. get with your ex then apply for custody of your little buggers and we'll bugger off to tuscany i'm in your cufflinks and tucks living comfortably bloody luxury being you sucks to be whether you rap whether you rock or whether you roll yo what is this accent is this like a a gentleman high high uppity accent the rose that he's doing i insist that you relinquish all control we're playing <laughs> rugby and the ball's your soul so pass it back to double b and we'll all interesting it's almost kind of got like a like a little fusion like a little little dash of like new orleans kind of jazz in it towards the end of that raps rack on tour back on tour i'll blap a crap reviewer sacre bleu <laughs> that's one fewer wrong doer i'm wrong due an apology and i want you to give one to me if you ever listen to a rapper and it wasn't me i'll pull off my tracky bottoms and give you a tracheotomy i'll leave you looking like a child eating broccoli ticking you off saying chew your food properly okay. i operate a strict sick lyrics only policy so originality is a pretty big priority That'd be that that'd be very tough. Imagine writing your lyrics and everything. You think you sound super original and then you bring it up to Dan Bull and he's just like mm. I lyrically proceed the Iliad and Odyssey. They found my lyric pad within a Celtic monastery. Follow Gilgamesh's genealogy through Ptolemy. Anyone of quality, they probably just copy me. Ooh. Now, see, Dan Bull's been doing things, he's been doing this for a very long time. Right. One of the OGs on YouTube and a whole lot of people, you know, current people that I listen to right now would give credit that not, they don't they didn't necessarily they didn't copy Dan Bull, but they would say that his rhymes like definitely inspired them to start rapping. You know what I mean? And he, to compare himself to the Iliad and Odyssey and everything, because it was some great works of writing. <laughs> what do you all think about that comparison? Follow Gilgamesh's genealogy through Ptolemy. Anyone of quality, they probably just copied me. So are my sonnets prophecy or an anomaly? A little bit of column A, a bit of column B. Whether you rap, whether you rock, or whether you roll, I insist that you relinquish all control. We're playing rugby and the ball's your soul. So pass it back to double B.
Within a few years, the elephants are gonna die. But Guys, what does what does dogably do mean? Y'all tell me that down in the comments, okay? That was an interesting turn. Okay, did 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 his broccoli bar start to lose popularity, right? One million down to three hundred thousand, down to two hundred thousand. Were you guys just not feeling it? I mean, that definitely was a complete change from with from the first one. Okay, the first one will probably be my favorite right now, but let's see what the third one's about. Wiggly Wiggly. The following video contains material of a mature, immature, and advertiser unfriendly nature. Frankly, it's disgusting. If that doesn't sound like your cup of tea, you should turn the video off now because as soon as I lick this broccoli, there's no turning back. I'm ready. It's all on you. Let's go. Hello. <laughs> Scholarly discourse. My full name's Chilton of DGLB Digby. My diet consists strictly of single malt whiskey. Okay. I'm particularly sesquipped and daily, and I've not published a single literary failure. And I oh, these freaking words, bro. Yo, he flexing on us. I've not published a single literary failure. Dude's been straight factual with his literal, literally literacy. That's what he's saying to us. Speculate that mainly thanks to the fact that I don't even write books. I just rap. Ha! Trust that. Yes. I'm a distinguished linguist whose voice is weapon of choice is English. A rhythm wrecking rhetorician getting recognition for the fact that I'm swagger's dictionary definition. Yo, a rhythm wrecking rhetorician getting recognition for the fact that I'm a swagger's dictionary definition. Oh, that whole pop bar was tight. On first look, you're ready for the second listen. I took your sister to third base, cherry picking, heavy hitting it with incredible no. edition. It's a travesty you haven't seen me rapping on your television. I'm Cheltenham, Dougalby, Digby. My witty words make you willy feel all wiggly. I'm Cheltenham, Dougalby, Digby. If folk don't dig me, they don't know diddly. Allow the crime scene for the time being. I turn the G into a C. Crime scene. I'm the nightmare to come and wreck. Okay. <laughs> B, I turned the G into a C. Feel like a gangster to a crime scene. <laughs> crime scene. I'm the nightmare to come and wreck your nice dream. I'll open up your top like a double decker sightseeing. Ooh. I ripped the Rolex off of Wiley. Oh, yeah. And now I wear it in my jacket pocket by my tie, see? I'm the reason that your wife's seen the dry cleaner. <laughs> Imbibing my seed like white beaner. You on a dry cleaner, homie? Her live stream at widescreen as she lies semen spit on her cheeks like a child eating ice cream. She might need a new dress. Not me. Not me. And as he said that, my son was just eating ice cream the other day. That was not an image I wanted to see. Lewinsky, I'm going mental on your cruise set, Klaus Kinski. I'll kick your mumsy in the mimsy with an air of whimsy, then throw it down the stairs like a slicky. I'm Cheltenham, Dougalby, Digby. My witty words make you willy feel all wiggly. I'm Cheltenham, Dougalby, Digby. If folk don't dig me, they don't know Digby. So Dougalby, Dougal, Dougalby is his middle name? Give me a mo, bro, Digby. We'll make your hoe go giggly, oh so quickly. Giggly. The popo giggly. tried to photo fit me. I simply did this, so they let me go. Victory. I don't have any history, lathered in mystery. Someone phone Agatha Christie. My breath smells of a packet of Wrigley's mixed with whatever the hell my tobacconist gives me. I'll piggyback on the back of a pygmy, screaming quickly, quickly, what? while I'm jabbing his kidneys. From the Indies to Sydney and in between, a Cold War submarine is my limousine. A libertine with the sympathy of Mr. Bean, a prick that means to be inflammatory, so bring your antihistamines. I'm Mr. Venus. I bring a list of misdemeanors bigger than your sister's penis. What? How pissed a scene is. This man's vocabulary is insane. The type of stuff, the type of words that this man can string together is just. He's right, man. On your first look, you ready for a second listen. Just so you can catch what you missed. And you know you missed. He he make this. He was he was sitting there writing. He's like, yeah, man. We know they're gonna about to miss all this. <laughs>
Okay, he's just spazzing, bro, and not the price is right, uh, uh, font. <laughs> I'm shouting them, Duggle me, dig me, my witty words Double make you will it feel all wiggly. I'm shouting them, Duggle me, dig me, if folk don't dig me, they don't know diggly. What? Bitches, <laughs> scoundrels, villains, anyone that's up to mischief, this one's for you. Giddy video, okay. A severe and continuing lapse in my dietary judgment. I don't expect to be forgiven. I'm just here to apologize. <laughs> Amen. So I'm guessing I'm sitting here wondering the lapse in views and everything. I wonder if because maybe they didn't necessarily like the the way that he the the the, the, the direction that he took and everything. And my my chair just went down. We just gonna keep it down while I talk from, from up from down here. I guess he didn't really like the vision or something. I'm not really too sure. But I thought they were all very unique, you know, and when it comes to like rap, especially when it comes to the presentation, the uniqueness, right, like right that uniqueness sometimes will cut what keeps like rapping and stuff like this alive, right? Instead of everybody sounding the same. I said it before in my other reactions, man. Don't nobody sound like Dan Bull. And it's hard to have your own style. All right, y'all. Y'all let me know which one of these broccoli bars was your favorite. That's the end of this video. If you enjoyed the content, leave a, leave a like and subscribe. Dave's out.